the first candidate for the 2024 Don't Tell Mama NBA's biggest douchebag of the year is Golden State Warriors forward Draymond Green. Oh, my gosh. He was suspended indefinitely in mid-December for nailing Phoenix Sun Center Yusuf Nurkic with a spinning closed fist directly in the face while posting up. He was just posting up. Nurkic went down and stayed down for a bit. This was about a month after he put Rudy Gobert in a headlock and drug him a few feet across the floor. Now he got a five-game suspension for that. That didn't matter. This this instance is also after he stomped on DeMontis Sabonis in the playoffs last season. And let's not forget when he kicked poor Steven Adams right in the fucking nuts Ooh, for the, when the, he was playing for the Thunder. Ooh, that one hurt me, Cole Breezy. That one hurt me. Draymond went through counseling this season and he remained away from the team for about a month after that Nurkic haymaker. Quote from Draymond after he hit Nurkic, I sell call I sell calls with my arms. End quote. He's a freaking flopper. Max, it's interesting that no one does anything to Draymond after these altercations. Go back and look at all these instances. No teammates are coming in throwing punches. There's there's no retaliation from Steven Adams or Sabonis or Gobert or even Nurkic. Nope. No no for no, no for those guys went after Draymond. I think that's wild. What do you think about Draymond, Draymond's candidacy here? This Draymond not only is one of the biggest douchebags this year, but I think if we were to do in the history of the NBA, this guy might very well be in the top five. There's He's a handful there. of them. I would like to do this one of these days. Maybe all time. All time. We, we can definitely find a, a bucket, a bucket full of them. Okay, but... <laughs> Rick and Draymond, though, man, the things that he does on the court is just ridiculous. And the fact that, like, what? He gets a slap on the wrist. The, the yeah. NBA is just like, oh, Draymond. Five, oh. A five-game suspension for dragging Rudy Gobert by his fucking neck. The heck was that? The okay. heck was that? What, he might have got suspended one game for kicking Stephen Adams in the nuts? Maybe. 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 Maybe maybe, maybe a $20,000 fine, which is pocket change for them. When yeah. they go up and hit, use that money in the club. Literally, literally in his in the pocket. Club bottle service. Uh, also, Draymond, if you, if you didn't see this during March Madness, he got his own commercial. Mm. So not only is he doing this shitty shit, the shitty shit, <laughs> he's doing this crap on the court, but then off the court, they're rewarding him for being such a jackass. Yeah. What the heck is that all about, Cole Breezy? He's got, he's got his own podcast. He's bumping his gums a lot on there. Draymond, back-to-back -back seasons uh, as a candidate for the, for the biggest douchebag in the NBA. Back to back seasons. He's definitely the biggest hard head. Uh, you know, poor Steven Adams with the I, I mean, his his nuts went up to his brain from that. Okay. All right. I don't know if Steven Adams, you know, Steven Adams used to have a deep voice. Oh. I don't know if it's gonna be like that anymore. Oh, okay, Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean Dray Draymond Green, man, he might have my vote. He might have my vote. This guy he pisses me off, to be honest, Cobra. He really pisses me off. I can't stand the guy. Uh, I can't wait till he's out of the league. The league will be a little bit better with him gone.